yes, the joys of geocaching. <laughs> we've walked up way up this field. I started our plaps in it. Then we've realised pretty quickly we've gone the wrong way. We've got to go a different route. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome once again as you join us on our quest to get towards our target of 3,000 geocaches in total for this year, 2022. Today we're having a walk around the outskirts of RAF Newton. It is a former RAF airfield and I will give you a bit of history on it later on. So please enjoy. And please remember to give it a like and if you're not subscribed, please feel free to go ahead and subscribe. Currently on 2558. And we're heading up to find 2559. It's a beautiful little place. A beautiful little place. And kids park up there. And decent sized kids park and all. They're wandering over that way somewhere. And they're doing what the dear bastion is walking up and down, like yo-yos. <laughs> Let's see if they have any luck. Can you find anything? Right, we found that one then, so... 2559, I think that was. Oh, lovely day for a walk, isn't it? Yep, it's not muddy, which I was worried about it being really muddy. So let's just get out and do some walks while we can. It takes his mind off everything else, I suppose. That's it. A little bit anyway. Squirrel there, look. Hey, he's got some hurt, he's got some hurt. Oh no. He's there, look. He's got... Oh, he's got leaves. Oh, he's making a nest. Making a nesting tree. That's his nest there, look. <laughs> Two done. A very tricky, sneaky hide. It's off this path. And it's windy around here. But yeah, it is here. It's got to look for it. It's in this location. If you can find it, good luck. You can see that hit the target, Newton Business Park, with the old RF symbol. Sort of banging it middle on it. And there's our old part of the old road and their new housing estate up there. Gandalf! Ga Gandalf, where are you looking yeah. for the cash? Yeah. Okay, next time you need to find the cash. It's all of it's too hard, no it's not. I found one, Mummy's found one, and Lewis has found one so far. It's the next year cash found. Not a tricky one at all, this one. It's pretty easy. And there's the old building still for the RF base over there. You can see. Care for you two. Near the signs. Two of them in that one. Oh, yeah. Elmo. Elmo! Graffiti artist Elmo! Elmo, who is appeared again. 
and frog. I like that snail, that's pretty cool. It was a jasmine find. This was a jasmine find. Jasmine, if you find it, you have to, you have to put it back. That's usually how it works. All right. This is a jasmine find. Oh, but uh, you found one, does didn't you? See, told you so that was geocache two five six four, and now we're heading that way over the fields. Yes, the joys of geocaching. <laughs> we've walked up well, this field. I started our plops in it. Then we've realised pretty quickly we've gone the wrong way. We've got to go a different route to get to the geocache. We've got, we're now heading back. Right, now we're on the right path. Now we're going the right way. Seems more accurate, there's a man in front of us. I'll show you where we were. It, may, it might be that there was a way around it, but... Oh, it's an old rower line. This is an old rower line. It's an old rower line, George. It's moss that's gone over the rower line. If you put it, I'll just kick it off. See? Yeah. I think this might be a station. They're building, uh, building a racetrack there. Interesting. Kind of does look like a platform. I don't know what it could have been a platform for. Jazz, it's almost like it looks like a platform, this does. No pla well, There's the rower lines there, look. I don't know, Jazz. I've no idea. It does look like a platform. The, uh, whatever that was, sidings or old station or whatever. We found the next year cash. So that's the next one done. I've totally lost count of where we are. We've done seven, seven today. But I've lost count of when we, were, when we started. So seven today so far. We'll have a look in a bit when we stop for a minute. We'll stop and I'll have a look. I can't quite remember. Horsies! Hello! Oh, that one gets around. And frog. I don't say frog on that one though, it says ROT. 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 Rot, not frog. I'll take a photo of it. Before we cross, hold on. Before we cross. Okay. The lad crosses, no trains coming. People way. found. Oh, yeah, that was tough. We found it though. A tough little one than that. Very tough. Lewis is watching the helicopter. From watching us. Okay. Yeah. So now we're on another part of the old RF Newton airbase. Now, I could have potentially flown my drone here, but I'm not sure I can because we're not that far from an actual airfield and there's loads of planes flying around dead low today. Probably they use this as a reference point because it's towards the airfield. I've got to try and work as magic now and work out which way we've got to go. Because, oh, it's buzzing. I must be here then. Right, we got that cash. Got that geocache, cash, didn't we? And uh, we're now going to go down and get another one because there's another one down here somewhere. Just got to find it. We'll see if we can find it. 
me and Jasmine, this one. And we're going to walk back now where we came and work our way around to that, around the side of these buildings. Built in 1939, Newton was assigned to number one group in June 1940. In July 1940, 103 Squadron RAF moved from RAF Honington with their fairy battles before changing to the Vickers Wellington in October 1940. The Squadron then moved in 1941 to RAF Elsham Wolds. Also on the 3rd of July 1940, 150 Squadron RAF arrived from Stradintal, so again initially with the battle before changing to the Wellington. So uh, a lot of the squadrons have been moving around here, uh, as you can see. Uh, at 3.30 on the 1st of May 1941, a low-level German raider dropped two sticks of bombs across the airfield, injuring two airmen. Newton then became a training base, and for the next five years, between July 1941 and December 1946, number 16 Polish Flying Training School provided basic and advanced training for Polish airmen serving with RAF using RAF Tolerton as a satellite landing ground. The following units were posted to Newton during this time. The Grand Defence Squadron between April and December 1941. Number 722 Grand Defence Squadron between December 1941 and the 1st of February 1942. Number 2722 was based here in 1942 and detachment number 2 at the Flying Instructor School between 1943 and 1944. So this place housed lots of different units over the years but by um, June 1995 as part of changes to the RF Grand Training the MOD announced the relocation of the headquarters of the Air Cadets from Newton to Cranwell in Lincolnshire and basically by March 2000 it was announced that RF Newton would be disposed of because it was basically it was underutilised and cost too much to operate. Lots of people have DNF'd this one, well the last two people have DNF'd it but we found it straight away. You just need to put your fingers on it. So yeah easy peasy just takes a bit of searching that's all. But it's definitely there. Yeah, so you weren't going crazy on the last one. I did miss a geocache out. I forgot to uh, add it. So we're coming up here um, as we're walking around. It's really windy. But we found some old structure here. So I'm guessing it was some gun placement or radar. Small radar or something like that. Okay, everyone. So let you know what's happened since the last recorded. Right, so we got to a... Um, a geocache location and it was a 4.5 difficulty and just as we started looking at it we came across another geocacher very lovely lady um, we uh, spent a bit of time together and uh, were able to find it when I say we Lewis found it yep that's right Lewis little genius that he is found it but yeah team effort we spent ages looking for it and we managed to find it so we've done that and then we found another one since then and now we're doing a multi and as you can see this rock does say Newton on it 2000 and I do believe that is when the base closed and these are the homes of where the soldiers lived and then you would have drove up that lane there and you would have been confronted by a guard post I do believe so yeah we found the lady uh, so I met the lady and uh, she's gone off to do her thing now to go and do these, this multi that we've started we're a little bit behind her so over to Wellington Avenue and uh, then we'll continue I think she's geocaching oh, we've just found a geocache there and our geocaching friend I'm sorry I don't think the ashy name is actually looking around with the parkage for the next geocache. It's around this area somewhere. I don't know if it's where she is or not. Oh. We have found all the caches today. 
20. Not including the multi. It could actually be 21 today. I'm going to check this old pillbox out. This old pillbox, look. I'm going to make it into base jazz. Look. Old pillbox box. Yeah, you're brave enough to go around the pillbox. Probably smells a wee down there. So yeah. Really successful day. Geocaching, Jasmine. We found 20 geocaches today. It's good, isn't it? And you've got to find a park. And I'll do one photo here. And I'm going to write how many geocaches we're on so far in this video right now and that's the total we're on so far we might have the additional multi to tag on at the end but otherwise yeah cracking date lots of geocaches found Thank everyone to like and subscribe i hope you enjoyed this video and please continue joining us on our quest to get 3000 geocaches this year thank you and goodbye